wanted so desperately to apologize every day to, to, to darker skinned actresses, to say, I'm sorry that I'm, choked, I'm the one chosen. My mama looks like you. My mum looks like you and she... It's been very painful to have women that look like my mum. Feel like I'm not representing them. That I'm taking from them. Taking their men, taking their work, taking their truth. Hi guys, long time no hearing from me. So I'm sure you guys have seen the video of Thandaway Newton apologizing for being light-skinned and biracial. Now, I have already touched on something similar like this in a previous video. I do not advocate for us to be apologizing to dark-skinned women because like I have said before, we owe them nothing and they owe us absolutely nothing. Now, I don't really check for Mrs. Newton. She's been in a few things I've seen, like for Color Girls and Beloved. Not really a household name, but she gets work. But in true dark skinned women fashion, of course, these women literally rushed to prove her point by dragging and bashing lighter women and then playing victim when we retaliated. They seem to have been going extra hard during February to prove some type of point. Dandy didn't take anything from no dark-skinned woman. That shit was given to her fair and square. Like, do you think Coco Jones is apologizing for getting the role of Hillary Banks? I think the fuck not. What these women need to be doing is hitting up the white male casting directors and dragging them for their role in colorism. You know, the same white men they thirst over and swear are going to sweep them <laughs> off their feet from Blackistan. Me personally, I will never give up a bag to appease bitches that are still going to tell me I'm not black enough and I'm not doing well enough. Anyway, guys, tell me what you think and I'll see you in the next video.